All right, guys, now we're going to show you how to take the easy movable wall and push it forward. So right now it's configured for 31 passengers with zero trunk space. But we have a client who has 25 people in their group and they all have small bags, so they require trunk space. So we're going to take the same piece of equipment and push it forward. Now it gives our clients the illusion that we have multiple vehicles in our fleet, when in fact we just have one piece of equipment, that's one payment, that's one insurance payment, and it's just going to maximize revenue on this piece of equipment. So let me show you why this is so great and why we chose Gretsch and their easy move wall system. Open the door. Remember, watch out those steps. Taking one in the shin sucks. So, as always, you have your easy move the wall operating instructions. You can check it out there. It's always there in Gretsch buses. It comes standard. Gretsch makes these buses dummy proof. Really can't, you know, say enough about the product. So you'll come here, the main security pin. Anyone can lift it, it takes no strength. Pull up, twist to the side, lock it in place in the little indent. Now, we have to go to the interior of the bus for step two. Follow me. All right guys, now we're on step two. We're inside the vehicle. We're gonna wanna take these seats and flip them down. So very simple process. Right next to it, you'll see this little lever right here. Pull the lever up, your seats go down. Before you put your seats down, make sure your seat belts are in the seat. You don't want them getting caught on the edge there and blocking the, the way you move. Go down. Right underneath, you'll see this little lever, right where my hand is. See that? You pull that and just push up. Again, this requires no strength at all. Seat's now out of the way. We're gonna duplicate that to the same side. Seat belts are in, push. Underneath, lever right here. Up. Seat is out of the way. Now, we're going to come to this seat. These little red pins, we want to pull those up because it's secured to the floor. Up. Up. Now, that has released the back seat. This seat slides with the wall. It's always connected to it. Now that we have the red tabs up, now we begin to move the wall. You'll go to these sides here, here and here. You're gonna pull down these pins. Now, this slides extremely easily. Anyone can do it, forward, backward. You'll see that correction craftsmanship went around the edges. So you're perfectly covered. Come all the way up, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. And these pins, you'll see that it stops right here. This is where you insert the pins. So you pull your pin down and start to get it in place. That is how you enter. Then you'll go underneath the seat, those little red tabs on the center seat, you'll push down on them to lock, and then you have to go to the trunk for the third and final step, and you're all set. Third and final step to make sure your wall is totally secure and doesn't slide. You're gonna come back to your trunk. You're gonna go up these next steps. Make sure you hold on the handrails for safety. The main pin right here, you're just gonna pull up on it slightly, drop it down, and then you wanna make sure it clicks right into place which it did. It's right in the ring, it's completely secure, the wall isn't going anywhere, and now you have all this trunk space to fit tons of client bags all the way to the ceiling.